Janome. Hey everyone, it's Janome Man, aka Michael Smith, and I'm back at my classroom at the Janome Sewing and Learning Center to share with you even more of the fabulous goodies that come with your brand new beautiful Janome Continental M17. Now, when you unpack everything, make sure you look for this page that says Standard Accessories, and it shows you a picture and a description of everything that's included with the machine. All the presser feet that I went over in in a previous video and then yes things like all the needle plates the optic magnifiers oh and then yes all the accessories for embroidery because yes our Continental M17 is an embroidery combo machine sewing quilting and embroidery so make sure all the parts and pieces are included with your machine and then yes look at all what comes for the embroidery component now, some of these I've already demonstrated and talked about in the previous video about all the presser feet, but we'll go over a review because these are generally everything you're going to be using for embroidery. So included is this cable, which the USB port will connect into your computer and this port will connect into your sewing machine because yes, your Continental M17 comes with some fabulous software that you can use to transport embroidery designs from your computer into your machine using this cable, if you so choose. The Janome Continental M17 is also certified Wi-Fi, so you could send those designs via Wi-Fi as well. Now included, oh, I already talked about the embroidery foot, of course. If we're going to be doing embroidery, we're going to be using that P embroidery foot. But because Janome is all about options, all about providing more, we have things like this little holder here for your yarn and two embroidery feet, additional feet. This is the PC1 and PC2. These are your embroidery couching feet and they have little openings there for various sizes of yarns that you can couch over using your embroidery machine. And all of these pieces you will use for embroidery couching, including this funny little thing, is a hook that's going to go on top of your thread mast that's built into the machine and your yarn is going to hook over that for when you do your embroidery couching. So all of these are included for embroidery couching. But also, oh, this is what we've been waiting for. You know, Janome really does listen to feedback. And for many years, people have been asking, I want to improve the placement of my embroidery. How can I do that? Well, Janome has always provided options. And now one of them debuting with this fabulous Continental M17 is this laser light right there attached to the PM embroidery foot. So this will connect into the machine, providing us that laser light for that precise embroidery placement. So how perfect is that? Debuting with this machine. Now also included is our special embroidery bobbin holder. Maybe you'll be able to see the little numbers in there. It says 20 grams, meaning that this bobbin holder is set to a higher tension. So that'll pull your needle threads to the back so you won't see any bobbin thread up to the top. Now, Janome's uh, traditional high tension bobbin holder is normally it has a little yellow dot. It's actually a little triangle, but we often called it the yellow dot bobbin holder that has that higher tension. But because the Janome Continental M17 is such a unique and very special machine, its high tension embroidery bobbin holder is actually white little dot there as opposed to yellow. So this way for sure you don't want to mix it up with any of your other bobbin holders. This is exclusive to the Continental M17. Another first. <laughs> now also included, oh I absolutely love this bobbin thread, Janome bobbin thread, 90 weight, a nice fine thread. It actually comes in the middle of, you may be wondering what in the world is all this? Well, this 
is a whole roll, you unroll it all, this is a whole roll of stabilizer, various sizes and various widths of stabilizer, various uh, thicknesses, this is like a heavy uh, felt even. So various stabilizers to get you started right away and the bobbin thread. Now, when you run out of this, you can get more from your Janome dealer as well. Uh, the 90 weight bobbin thread, again, perfect for your embroidery. And then again, the various stabilizers, you can also get more stabilizer from your Janome dealer, but it's wonderful to have a little sampler pack when you get started. All you need is a little bit more extra fabric and chances are you have that. <laughs> now the embroidery hoops, oh, I couldn't wait to unpack these. Here we go, we've got five included in total with the Janome Continental M17. So one thing I love about all of our embroidery hoops, oh yes, they are labeled here with the plastic uh, grid that you uh, remove, make sure you remove this, but this is helping you for that precise embroidery placement, uh, but they're all labeled. So this is the SQ, meaning it's square. This is the SQ10D. And that little D is unique to the Janome Continental M17. We have A hoops, we have B hoops, and now we have D hoops, which means this hoop can only be used in the Janome Continental M17. You'll see that it's got a very unique way of attaching to the embroidery carriage for the Continental M17. So that's why all the hoops with a little D mean that it's for the Continental M17. So this is a hundred by a hundred, or if you're like me and you're more of a feet and inches kind of guy, <laughs> uh, that it's 3.9 by 3.9 inches inside this grid. Now all of the Janome Continental M17 hoops have this fabulous quick release clamp system, no more little thumb screw to turn, so it makes it very quick and easy. This uh, clamp system debuted on the uh, Memorycraft 550E and again was so widely uh, well received, so popular, so Janome said fine, we'll do it to all of these ones. Now you'll notice all of these hoops have these little black tick marks. These help us as well with our accurate embroidery placement when we use our special AccuSetter app, one of the free Janome apps we can use on our iPad for, again, that precise embroidery placement. So Janome tries to think of everything. So hoop number one. Hoop number two, the RE, meaning rectangular, 20D which is 140 by 200 millimeters or five by five by 7.9. So five by five by 7.9. This is the hoop everybody wants. The most universally used hoop size for most designs. Again, we've got so many designs built into the machine, but we can also purchase designs and bring them into the machine. Again, this five and a half by 7.9 hoop Perfect, you're not gonna waste a lot of stabilizer, or again, it's large enough, you can combine some other designs too. Same uh, quick release system here, and again, all the hoops have the little notches here for the AccuSetter app, so perfect. Now, hoop number three, we're getting bigger and bigger each time. Ooh, I hope the camera can pick it up because they're so big. This is the SQ, so square, 28D. This is 280 by 280 millimeters or 11 by 11. I'll have to bring it way back. So yes, 11 by 11 again. Now you'll notice these little magnetic strips here. Well, yes, this is where we're going to use. There's eight small magnets included and eight large magnets included. So this is where when we hoop up our fabric, hoop up our stabilizer, we can use the magnets to hold the stabilizer and hold the fabric uh, taut in the hoop, but as well that helps it uh, prevent it from flipping back over and perhaps stitching over. So you can use these magnets to help hold it in place. So again, eight small magnets and eight large magnets for your various hoops. So that's fabulous. And oh, the big Mac daddy of it all. Yes, because of the fabulous 
13.5 inch throat space of the Janome Continental M17, we now have room for the, ooh, ta-da, giant 11 inch by 18.1 inch, or that's 280 millimeters by 460 millimeters, the big RE, so rectangular, Ooh, 46D. Now, another thing Janome always does, you see left and right. So then you know that, yes, you've got your grid here that's going to help you line up your design. You've got your grid on correctly. And again, that quick release system here. And what I love, because this hoop is so mammoth, and again, very, very special, then Janome has done the hoop in black uh, with the white little accents here for the AccuSetter placement. So again, they try to think of anything. And again, the uh, little magnets there. So how perfect is that? Now you'd think that would be enough, but oh no, with Janome, there's always more. How about this beautiful embroidery quilting ASQ 27D? So this is the special AccuFill quilting hoop. And then there you see it says uh, for Continental M17, the ASQ 27D hoop and Artistic Digitizer Junior. So this is yet another software program that your Janome Continental M17 comes with, the Artistic Junior software, and you'll see for Mac and Windows. So yes, Janome is always trying to think and always trying to listen to the feedback. Not everyone's a Windows owner. A lot of Mac people, you know, want to be able to use the same software. So Janome has developed the Artistic Junior uh, or Artistic Digitizer Junior and the regular full package of Artistic Digitizer was actually built on the Mac platform. So again, Janome is listening to that feedback. So here, this is included with your Continental M17, so you can start designing your own embroidery designs way to way. But yes, look at this beautiful 274 by 274 millimeters or 10.8 by 10.8 is the ASQ, so it is AccuFill Square 27D. So the wonderful thing about the AccuFill quilting hoop, we do have an AccuFill quilting system for the MemoryCraft 12,000, uh, the MemoryCraft uh, 11,000, the MemoryCraft 15,000, and yes, now we have AccuFill quilting with this giant hoop in the Janome Continental M17. The wonderful thing about the AccuFill quilting hoop, it's got these large magnetic strips on the edge. So this is where we're going to be using, look at the size of those, <laughs> these big magnets that that we're going to clamp down with our quilt project over the hoop. So this is a hard acrylic template. We're going to lay our quilt sandwich over the hoop and clamp it down with the big magnets. And when we do that, we're going to press this hard acrylic template down as we clamp it because that's going to flatten the batting, help make the fabric all nice and taut so we can turn our embroidery machine into a quilting machine. It is like having a long arm quilting machine in your sewing machine, in your embroidery machine, and again with this large 10 inch, 10.8 inch hoop, then you can do a lot of quilting and then you quickly unclamp with the magnets, move your quilt sandwich over to where you're going to start again, put your acrylic template down, clamp it all down, remove your acrylic template, very important, that's why these two little holes are here, <laughs> remove your acrylic template and boom, you can turn your sewing an embroidery machine into a long arm quilting machine. Now I did a whole uh, Facebook Live about AccuFill quilting kind of a beginner's guide that is on the Janome HQ YouTube channel. So you can, it's under the Facebook Live playlist. So you can go back to the Janome HQ YouTube channel to find more about AccuFill quilting. And of course, 
You can look forward to more upcoming videos on the Genome HQ YouTube channel all about AccuFill quilting and all about how to use your fabulous brand new Genome Continental M17. Mm -hmm.